way they go, and Luton Chante comes out a little slow, so also does Miramar Reef, but they were only left a couple of lengths or so, and straight into the lead goes the pacemaker Cataldi. It's Cataldi cutting out the pace, already some four or five lengths clear, of stablemate Raft in second, then the favourite Free Guest settles down in third, then behind her showing four is Elegadere, five Ptolemeo, then six Cannes, seven Romilda, one of four for France, followed by another Frenchman, Palace Music, on the outside of Morcon. They're going a tremendous gallop. They've covered two furlongs already, and it's Cataldi blazing the trail, well clear of Raft two, Free Guest three, Elegadere four, Cannes five, then Ptolemeo six, Romildo seven. After these come Morcon, then Miramar Reef on the outside, hat him on the rails. Then Bob back, behind Bob back, towards the outside is Pebbles with Palace Music. And the last two are both Frenchmen, Carrier Law and Luton Chante. They're coming now down towards the halfway point in this Dubai Champion Stakes. And still out in front where he's been throughout so far is Cataldi, the pacemaker, really setting a tremendous gallop. From Raft in second place, behind these two, Lester Pickett has the favourite free guest, well placed in third. Those are the first three, and here's Graham. A lot of daylight between Cataldi and Raft, and then in the uh, white face, the jockey Lester Pickett on free guest, back in third place. Hatim makes grand, they've got three furlongs to go. And it's Cataldi really stretching them from Raft. Then Hatim third, so it's Carla Dabdala, one, two, three, in the Dubai champion stakes. Then comes Free Guest, also trying to make up ground is Elegant Air. Just in behind these, Romildo coming with a run. They race down into the dip. They've got a furlong and a half to go. And Cataldi is coming back to his field, challenged now by Raft. Free Guest is edging towards the centre of the track. Romildo is staying on well. Hatim is under pressure. Palace Music with the white face on the very wide outside. They're inside the final furlong. And Palace Music finishing very fast, also finishing very fast. On the very wide outside is Pebbles. And Palace Music goes on from Pebbles as they go up towards the line. Palace Music from Pebbles. Palace Music with a Pebbles in second. Raft is third. Then Cataldi 4, Free Guest 5, Romildo 6, Morcon 7, Ptolemeo 8, Hatim 9, Elegandere 10. Then came Carrier Law, and the back barkers include Miramar Reef. Also towards the rear was Luton Chante, who was struggling virtually throughout, and also Bob Back. And so the result of this Dubai Champion Stakes. It's a win for number 13, Palace Music, owned by Mr. Uh, Nelson Bunker Hunt, trained in France by Patrick Bianco, ridden by Yves Saint Martin, his first victory in England this season, but his third in the Champion Stakes, having won it with Flying Water in 77 and Veyran in 81. And officially, it's a photo between Palace Music and number 17 Pebbles, who's owned by Sheikh Mohammed, trained here at Newmarket by Clive Britton and ridden by Philip Robinson. That's the one, too. I think we'll find that Raft was third, but that's close as well because the pacemaker Cataldi lasted very well indeed uh, to be in that photo for third place. But Palace Music with the white face came with a rattling run inside the final furlong. You couldn't find him with radar with three and a half to go. It was a very, very strong pace, but Yves Saint Martin, who has uh, ridden Palace Music, had timed the thing to perfection to swoop through on the very wide outside.